friends, to some more of the Crew Motorfest. And in today's video, I think we're going to touch upon another playlist. And then after that playlist, uh, we're going to import the collection from the Crew 2. So, I think we're going to touch upon... Hmm... In a car for all these. I've already done those two. Yeah. Up, you buff horses. I've got seven questions that you need to answer by getting behind yep. the wheel of some of the I'm gonna drive a different car over there. New playlist ahead. Let's go. Yup. Give me the charger that we customized in the last video. The next experience we have in store will knock your socks off. These guys are the real deal. Their philosophy that cars are for everyone, combined with their electric energy, makes their content stand out like, I quote, a buff horse in a pasture of ponies. Hmm. I got a question for you guys, and buckle up, Buttercup, because it's doozy. Freaking lightning, baby! <laughs> Listen up, you buff horses. I've got seven questions that you need to answer by getting behind the wheel of some of the most iconic cars the world has ever seen. Here we go. Boom. The car world is made up of rivalries and unanswered questions. You need to settle them once and for all. More power, baby! Will it be easy? Uh, I don't think so. That's why I love it. He gives the people what they need to hear. Lightning, 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 lightning! <laughs> and in the end, I need you to answer the biggest question of them all. Who rules the streets? That is the most badass thing I have ever heard of. <laughs> More power, baby! This game is fucking great. <laughs> this is the streets. Rolling! Not a lot of events. They're all pretty close by. So this playlist is actually going to be pretty easy. Another activity awaits. We're not staying in Honolulu just yet. We'll be joining the donut team at the bottom of the mountain. They need you to conduct a special experiment before settling down in the city. I'm not going to lie. James wants to start big here. Yep. We're just going to jump right into a uh, Lamborghini or Ferrari? What are we jumping into? Ferrari and Lamborghini have been rivals since they were babies. It's true. But don't look it up. Before we set up camp downtown, you'll be racing through the countryside in the Italian supercar of your choice. Either the Ferrari F12 Merlinetta or the Lamborghini Huracan. Which beast owns the mountain? The Italian Stallion or the Stromboli Bully? Considering that we drove a Huracan not too long ago, I'm going to go with the Ferrari. The Ferrari. Saddle up, you Italian cowboy. Lamborghini 
versus Ferrari. Man, I am so pumped. Shit. Hey, uh, no pressure, but these cars are like really expensive, so try not to crash and burn, okay? I'm in a Ferrari, I have no promises. Don't sue me. Fuck. I mean, I really gotta admit, the crash noises in this game are violent. Hellcat's really fun to drive. I don't know why. Yeah! All right, tough boys and girls, you think you've got muscles? <gasps> well, how about you take it to the streets in a Chevy Camaro ZL1 or a Shelby Mustang GT500 to find out <gasps> who's got the biggest American muscles? Oh. Spoiler. It's me. That... That's a Riff Edition Camaro, right? I do like a Mustang. I do. But that's a... Hmm. I want to drive the Camaro. The Camaro ZL1. Go get that dinner. Huh? My God, we're like evenly matched. Where in the muscle cars and Habitat, the concrete jungle. How's it feel? Didn't think muscles. 
muscle cars could turn like that, did you? And I have 10,000 pounds of wing on my back, so... All this practice is finally paying off! That car's muscle. I'm flexing right now. You just can't see it. Hmm. Beep, beep, boop, 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 boop. Sorry, that's just the drone talking. He's very excited. Don't mind him. Do live in Hawaii? Who's got the buffest American muscles? Let's find out. for that curve. Where's that GT500 at? Doesn't matter. Showing the right with Donut Media so far. Let's dive even deeper into their world then. The Donut Crew has all kinds of shows on their channel. In one of them, missions. It's called Hilo, and that's exactly what you're going to get a taste of now. And during this workshop, you'll be driving the oh-so-lovely Nissan 370Z Nismo. These are not the same 350Zs, but oh well, Nothing you do what you want. Nothing is more iconic than low car, <laughs> except for high car. In this time attack, you'll get to drive both 370Zs for one lap each on the same track to find out for yourself what the difference between cheap mods and expensive mods really is. Can you beat your own time switching from low car to high car? Show us then. Does more expensive mean more better? <laughs> I mean, yeah. No. Definitely. It doesn't. We did it in real life. All right, hot shot. Let's see what you can do with that setup coming straight from the sail rack. Give it the beat.
got to put myself under the disturb. I wonder what won! God. More power, baby! Motorfest gave us two hypercars with more power than anyone would ever need. Choose between the Bugatti Centurice and the Ponigzig, Jesco, and race through downtown Honolulu. Which car will set the new downtown speed record? And who will split an order of shaved ice with me? Hey, can we get some shaved ice on set? Oh, yeah, good luck. Oh shit, Koenigsegg or Bugatti. I've never driven a Koenigsegg before in any of the crew games. Actually, that's not true. I have an Agera for drifting, but that's different. Mm, I don't know. Cento Dietti is really cool. I've never driven one. Gonna go to Chenzo Diechi. Whoa! Someone woke up in a new Bugatti. God damn it! Sweet 
Holy shit. Oh, they're fast. Who'd have thought? This car is too fast. You are a psychopath. I love you. Thanks, man. Slightly scratched the paint. Don't worry about it. Didn't happen. After the docks, how about a little tour of the countryside? Neighborhood. Pretty sure you're ruining the property values, though. Oh, shit. downtown speed record, but which car's gonna set the new record? The suspense is killing me. I gotta sit down. Three hundred and fifty kilometers per hour in the city? I don't know, that's gotta be at least a hundred miles an hour. Yeah, at least. God damn, crossing the finish line at 250 miles per hour is crazy. Is your chance to get sideways, muchacho. You'll be drifting this Mitsubishi Lancer Evo X up and down the corkscrew. The only one you're competing in this challenge against is yourself, just like in life. Can you get all steezy with your slide? And how long can you maintain your drift? All right, we'll find out. <laughs> Los 
Lancer Evo. My friend said it was the fastest car that he's ever driven. What's up, Dan? I bet you never thought you'd be in a video game. Yeah, can't confirm. The drifting in this game is really nice. Can you drift as long as the Kentucky Cobra? I gotta know! This is gonna make a dope video. You should subscribe to Donut Media. Already am. Uh, I'm serious. Go do it. Already am. certified drifter wait am I gonna have to do better than myself or what oh okay is that it okay going fast brings incredible sensations for sure but no need to reach extreme speeds to get a proper challenge meaning well You'll have to go to Honolulu Airport and get on the tarmac to figure it out. The team is waiting for you there with a whole different type of car this time. A high-performance pickup truck by Ford, the F-150 Raptor. Thank you, in my dream truck. You're closing in. Gather all your focus and dexterity. You're gonna need it. So we know you're a capable driver. What if you don't have any brakes? You'll what? be driving this Ford Raptor SVT, and I say driving, but you're stuck in cruise control and you cannot use your brakes. Oh. <laughs> and did I mention every lap you get faster? So how clean can you drive when slowing down isn't an option? I'm fucking sorry? What? <laughs> huh? Riddle me this, Coneheads. How do you win when everyone's going the same speed? That's right, your cruise control is locked and you've got to weave through a whole bunch of cones. But don't even think about touching them. This is simple. Each cone that you touch gets you a penalty. Make a perfect lap and you get a big ol' bonus. Imagine each cone is the cutest, buffest horse you've ever seen. You wouldn't run over a horse, would you? Nay, sir. Nay. Well, I guess that's one lap. Good job. I don't know if your robot assistant told you, but I may have forgotten to install the brakes. Oh shit. Oh. I've got your bomb on speed dial, so you better keep your driving clean and tidy. No. -uh. No oh, what the fuck? Well, I'm starting to get an idea. Dude! Shit! Oh my god, I can't fucking... <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, is this truck too big for you? No. Too bad! 
We're good. Clever girl. Get it? Get it? Like in the movie? Turn, you big bitch! I guess that works. Damn it. Well done. I hope it was as fun for you to try as it was for me to watch. Oh my god, just give me the firebird, please. This colorful playlist is almost coming to an end. I can't wait to see how the donut crews use all the incredible sequences they shot with you. They're almost ready to wrap up. But before, they have one more challenge for you. One last face-off. A little pure, unadulterated street racing. Featuring two cars that embody the world-renowned German savoir-faire. Well, it looks like I've said too much again. Just pretend you didn't hear anything, okay? Oh. M4 versus R8. You can't say enough good things about German engineering. I've tried. In this final face-off, two powerhouses battle it out in the streets of Honolulu. Audi R8 Spider head to head with BMW M4. Who could ask for anything more? Let's find out once and for all. Who rules the streets? I'm gonna go with the R8 because we've already driven a lot of the M4 recently um, in the Liberty Walk playlist. Audi R8 Spider. Okay, sure. Prove me wrong. <laughs> okay, you think the M4 is gonna win? Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's fine. is the last event, so make it count. Don't worry, we'll still be friends after. Okay. I mean, you already knew me from the Mexican Horizon Festival, but sure. Stop 
goofing around. Fuck you mean goofing around? Should have been Mercedes in my opinion, but I guess we'll go with Audi. Ooh, did I get the uh, Firebird? Yes! Nice, I did all that and my next level is a goddamn t-shirt. Well, this truly was a thrilling ride. It was. But give me my damn car. Here it is. Plane is cleared and ready for takeoff, driver. Let's see what the challenges are for this and the rewards and whatnot. New challenges unlocked. You got 50k. Rule the streets outfit. Crew credits. Donut tires. Horn. Window tint. It's gotta be like an engine, right? And that's a horn or anything like Oh, it's a donut horn. The donut eater is amazing. Or if it's Stingray. The Drift Evo. The Raptor. I have the I think I have a Raptor. I should. I don't know if I have a GT five hundred. I definitely have a F twelve Berlinetta. I definitely have a three seventy Z Nismo. I have the M four. And I don't fucking have a Riff Edition. I told you it was a Riff Edition. God to damn it. Cool, dude. Alright. We gotta end off the video the with... Is ready to try. Let's go try it. We'll do that for next time. Before I end off the video, let's customize a car. I'm thinking... You know. Classic muscle time. The Chevelle SS. Not color, let's go to visual parts. I assume that there's gonna be a massive blower. Yup. I'm gonna go with it. Okay, can remove all the silver bits from the headlights and whatnot. Make them like LEDs too, or you could just simply remove a pair of headlights. Make the bumper painted, splitter. There's gonna be some hell. Oh, never mind. There's not really a lot of over at the top stuff. Like 
And is that all carbon fiber or is it just black? Give me this. Oh, wide body Chevelle would be crazy. Yes. Hmm. Sure. You make it like a like a black top. That's that's cool. But I am not gonna do that. I just want the wide body. Rear wings make or break them. Little ducktail's cool. Bigger ducktail. What in the hell? No. I like these tail lights. Not those ones. Those are a bit much. Okay, huge titanium exhaust. Cool. Ha. Huh. I like it. In terms of the color of the... Oh, dude. What kind of liveries do people have for this car? What in the hell? What are these liveries? Gross. What are these, like, white stripes for the car? All black Chevelle. That's cool. I'm going with this one. Some like muscle car esque rims. Yeah, let's go with these. Some thick old boys. But yeah. That's all we're going to do for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Take it easy. Love you all.